we're going to do a couple techniques with chicken. One is brining, and the other technique is simply quartering a chicken. The brining recipe is very simple. I simplify it <laughs> by writing the recipe right on my brining bucket. So I'm going to put in a cup of salt because I have four quarts of water and a four pound chicken, of course, and two cups of sugar. That looks sufficiently dissolved. And then I'm just going to drop my whole chicken in there. And I try to make sure the cavity gets filled up with the water. The brine not only infuses the chicken with the flavors of salt and sugar, but it also pushes moisture into the chicken. Quartering a chicken is very simple, takes less than a minute, and it is, of course, economical. So I start with my thigh drumstick combination. Sometimes I get it right away, and other times it takes a little guesswork. I'm just working my way around the chicken. See, that one was much faster. Extend the wing, and I just get the likewise, and that's off. I go right down the center. I slice it first because I want to kind of keep the skin intact. If I plan to use this to, uh, to roast it, the skin protects the, the meat and keeps it moist. Back to the thigh and drumstick. You got to feel around for that joint. There's two places that feel like a joint. Of course, only one is. That was pretty quick. Now I'll simply bag up my chicken according to the meals I plan to make, and I'll do the same with the wings and the back for chicken stock. I hope you enjoy whatever meal you make with your quartered chicken, and don't forget, always brine, especially if you're going to roast a chicken. See you next time.